It's a hard rubber reaction ball with a moderately erratic bounce. That means if I bounce it to waist height, it'll deflect up to 18 inches horizontally. Forces me to watch and react to each and every bounce. But it's not too erratic. I don't have to chase it all over the room. So I can bounce the ball really quickly. The faster I go, the more challenging it is. But it also keeps me at the best of my ability and keeps my brain fully focused. If my mind wanders, I'm gonna drop this ball. There are two core elements or exercises to be done using the cue ball. The first is called bounce and catch. You take one or two cue balls and you bounce them to waist height, alternating hands as you go. You try to go as fast as you can. You count how many bounces you can do in 60 seconds to keep track of how you're progressing. It trains eye-hand coordination, vision, and reaction time. The faster, the better. The next exercise trains peripheral vision. If you think about it, the center of our vision, the one we use to read with, is really quite small. Everything else is peripheral vision. So if we can train that, we expand our visual awareness. There's very little on the market that will do that, but the cue ball does it really fast and efficiently, and it, this is how it works. You do the same exercise again, but this time, instead of watching the balls as you bounce them, you fix your focus on a point on the ground, and you bounce the cue balls around that fixed point. They're erratic, and they're bouncing, and they're small. You have to track it with your peripheral vision and catch it with your hands. It'll increase your confidence and the ability to do that, and as you do it faster and more, your brain will automate that skill, so you don't have to think about it anymore. You'll just react and you'll react quickly. The cue ball adapts to anyone's skill level. You can go slow or you can go fast. It'll work with children as young as five years old all the way to the elderly. It'll make driving your car a better experience. You'll be able to see more of what's going on around you. If you're an athlete, you'll be able to see, hit, and catch better. If you're a student or an adult, you'll just simply get better at eye-hand coordination. You'll see better and your reaction times will become much faster. Makita Canada is proud to feature its complete lineup of cordless and electric autofeed screwdrivers. Designed for repetitive high volume driving applications, Makita autofeed screwdrivers offer functionality, versatility and superior driving power to ensure accuracy and ease of use on the job site. As a leader in cordless technology, Makita offers autofeed screwdrivers in both cordless and electric models. Models BFR540, BFR550, and BFR750 operate on a 14.4 volt and 18 volt lithium extreme technology batteries, which offer improvements over the conventional battery platforms, including longer run times and life cycles, and smart charging technology. Cordless models also offer versatility being able to work without worrying about extension cords and on site power. Makita LXT Auto Feed Screwdrivers work where you work. Electric models 6842, 6844, and 6845 offer the versatility of this type of tool and allows the operator to work all day from a sustained power source. Makita auto feed screwdrivers are also available in models that accept fasteners from 1 to 1 and 5 8, 1 to 2 and 3 16, or 1 and 3 quarters to 2 and 15 16. All Makita cordless and electric auto feed screwdrivers are equipped with several features that distinguish them as professional grade tools, including a rigid aluminum casing that incorporates dust proof construction to reduce the risk of dirt and debris, shortening the operational life of the tool by impeding smooth sliding action of the stopper base assembly. Contained within the casing is a driver bit and stopper base assembly that regulates the depth of drive. The stopper base can be set to accommodate various lengths of screws, while micro adjustments can be made in order to fine tune the countersink of the screw based on the materials and the application at hand. To increase durability and operational efficiency, Makita Auto Feed screwdrivers feature a silent clutch that offers smooth engagement of the drive assembly. The driver bit and clutch are synchronized to ensure the engagement occurs at the optimum position. This reduces operational noise and increases durability of the tool by reducing wear and tear on the clutch. The silent clutch also offers a direct drive transmission, providing the same amount of driving power in either forward or reverse gears. The screw guide keeps the collated strip in the proper position for driving and collapses easily to eliminate damage during storage or transit. A lock-on button enables continuous operation without constant application of the trigger, while the conveniently located forward and reverse switch makes it easy to change the operating modes. Externally accessible carbon brushes make on-the-job maintenance simple and easy. Brushes should be examined on a regular basis and replaced as a set when they have reached the wear line indicator on each brush. My name is Philip Isherwood. I'm the owner and founder of Saber Forge, and I'm coming to you from my headquarters just outside of Portland, Oregon. Ever since I was a kid, I've always 
love science fiction props and weapons, and none more than the lightsaber. Like a moth to a flame, I've always been drawn to it. I started this company seven years ago with one goal in mind. Make awesome custom sabers. Now, almost a decade later, I've honed my craft and I make some of the finest custom sabers in the world. I get to live my childhood dream. And now you can too. Adaptive saber parts are an easy to use, modular system that lets anyone construct their very own movie quality custom saber. We have lowered the barrier to entry. Now you don't need expensive machinery, soldering equipment, or years of crop building experience to make your very own custom saber. All you need is your imagination and our new adaptive saber parts. With our initial release, we will offer over a hundred unique metal parts in three different finishes, putting millions of different design configurations at your fingertips. And every month we will release a new expansion set, making the possibilities endless. In addition, we will offer plug and play, no solder electronics kits for upgrading your custom hilt to a dueling saber with a light up blade or a fully functional hero level prop, lights, motion detection, and sound. Adaptive Saber Parts are a comprehensive system that lets anyone build a movie quality prop. But these sabers aren't just for display. Our metal parts are made from precision machined aerospace grade alloys with a tensile strength as strong as structural steel. And our revolutionary saber blades are constructed from thick walled polycarbonate an extremely durable space-age polymer used in fighter jet canopies and bulletproof glass. We use a dual diffusion system with a frosted outer blade and a brightness-boosting internal film, which gives us the brightest thick-walled saber blade on the market. Other saber makers tell you to wrap packing tape around your blade tips so you don't lose it. We are the only company that threads our blades and blade tips, so you don't have to worry about a tip flying off while you duel. You can use these blades against any LED saber on the market, as well as kendo swords and even solid oak wooden bowkins. We are so confident in our quality and durability that we are the only saber company that offers a one year warranty on everything we sell. It's a hard rubber reaction ball with a moderately erratic bounce. That means if I bounce it to waist height, it'll deflect up to 18 inches horizontally. Forces me to watch and react to each and every bounce. But it's not too erratic. I don't have to chase it all over the room. So I can bounce the ball really quickly. The faster I go, the more challenging it is. But it also keeps me at the best of my ability and keeps my brain fully focused. If my mind wanders, I'm gonna drop this ball. There are two core elements or exercises to be done using the cue ball. The first is called bounce and catch. You take one or two cue balls and you bounce them to waist height, alternating hands as you go. You try to go as fast as you can. You count how many bounces you can do in 60 seconds to keep track of how you're progressing. It trains eye-hand coordination, vision, and reaction time. The faster, the better. The next exercise trains peripheral vision. If you think about it, the center of our vision, the one we use to read with, is really quite small. Everything else is peripheral vision. So if we can train that, we expand our visual awareness. There's very little on the market that will do that, but the cue ball does it really fast and efficiently, and it, this is how it works. You do the same exercise again, but this time, instead of watching the balls as you bounce them, you fix your focus on a point on the ground, and you bounce the cue balls around that fixed point. They're erratic, and they're bouncing, and they're small. You have to track it with your peripheral vision and catch it with your hands. It'll increase your confidence and the ability to do that, and as you do it faster and more, your brain will automate that skill, so you don't have to think about it anymore. You'll just react and you'll react quickly. The cue ball adapts to anyone's skill level. You can go slow or you can go fast. It'll work with children as young as five years old all the way to the elderly. It'll make driving your car a better experience. You'll be able to see more of what's going on around you. If you're an athlete, you'll be able to see, hit, and catch better.